When I saw the fasting advocate, I wanted to know what that means to you. Like, what does that really mean? Okay, let me let, let me give you guys a brief. Um, I used to weigh 125 kg. Mm. And I currently weigh 75 kg. I've kept that off for a couple of years. And um, in my journey of discovering health, and mm. when I was 125 kg, I was sick. I had a fatty liver, mm. high blood pressure, I should be diabetic. I had sleep apnea, which is really dangerous. I could be in this interview now, this program, and I'll fall asleep. Mm. You literally see me fall asleep, and I couldn't control it. So in my journey, when I, when I changed my lifestyle, until I discovered that food was medicine, my life never really changed. Mm. When I discovered that, then I understood that even though I was having good medicine, I was overdosing on the good medicine. So when I discovered the miracle of fasting, my life changed. Mm. All of us, most people on planet Earth, are eating too much. Mm. Let, me, let, 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 me, let me give you something that will sink in your head. How many people die of starvation in the world? There are more people dying of eating too much. Yeah. Mm. And people starving. Look at the people dying in the war fronts. They survive on little rations. They don't die. Mm. Even those horrible pictures they show of the kids with bare bones, mm. they are alive. So is your fasting dry or is it No, like it depends. We have, I mean, like I do this program called Fasting with Akins, where I coach a bunch of people on how to fast. And I mean, life changes in the, in the spirit. We have different cycles of fasting. There's a... Um, it's targeted fasting for certain hours. Mm. The times where we're dry, the times where we have a water only. Right. I think the longest we've done is five days of, that's 100, 120 hours of no food. This fasting, is a day for spiritual purposes or strictly for health purposes? I like that question, you see. Because the idea people have of fasting mm, is always fasting. spiritual. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you see, that's because religion pushed fasting. Mm. Now science has caught up with religion knowing that fasting is actually beneficial for the body. So by virtue of you abstaining from food, you will connect to your higher self. Mm. You don't have to be, look, even the people that watch Africa Magic, for instance, if they're going to do a sacrifice, they abstain from food. Why? Because there's something about food that lowers you from attaining your higher spiritual self. It, it lowers your vibration. So by virtue of staying away from food, you will connect to the spirit. However, whatever spirit you want to connect to is up to you. Yeah. So but, more spiritual than religion. So regardless of what your aim is, if you center your focus, you would, you would achieve the spiritual.